this house concert series live session is just one of the several ways we here at WHYY have been working to connect people and present engaging content during, uh, during these weird times, right? So we've held online reporter roundtable discussions. We've even held a, a Bob Ross paint along event uh, just to try to connect with folks in the community and, and do content in a different and new way uh, in this kind of new and weird world that we're all in. Uh, it's all part of our mission here at WHYY is your trusted news and arts and culture and educational programming source in the Philadelphia, South Jersey and Delaware area. Uh, and as your mem member supported NPR and PBS station, we thank all of the members who are in the audience today. Of course, without your support, we couldn't do programs uh, like this. And of course, uh, there'll be links to donate to WHYY at the end of the event. You can also go to whyy.org and click the donate button. Uh, and so as you know, uh, with everything that's happening in the world, I, I really think music has the power to connect us all and, and is so important in uh, all times, but especially now. Uh, and today we're featuring four incredible musicians, Jeffrey Gaines, Cliff Hillis, Joy Ike, and Eric Shankman. And uh, I'm excited to hear what they all have to uh, have to perform today for us. Uh, they've all been featured on WHYY's House Concert Series, which airs on uh, online at whyy.org and TV12. We're so glad they are live with us today. So without further ado, I'll get out of the way. It's my pleasure to introduce our first performer. He is singer, guitarist, songwriter, Jeffrey Gaines. He's been celebrated for his soul-searching lyrics and really powerful live performances. Rolling Stone calls him insistent, impassioned, full of self-knowledge, and they called him the voice of a new generation. So we're so happy to have him kick off our first ever WHYY House Concert Series live session. So join me in a virtual round of applause for Jeffrey Gaines. Thank you. How's it going? <laughs> Driving around, nothing to do. Every move I make leads me to you. Sweet summertime, so warm and green. Ain't felt like this since seventeen. Yeah, yeah. Hey, can you come back tonight? Million stars up in the sky. None need you by my side. Can you come out tonight? Hey, there it's me, I'm parked outside. Yeah, I thought that we might take a ride. Some place we never been. I ain't felt like this since I don't know when. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, can you come out tonight? It's so hard to keep it in inside. When I'm with you, I am alright. Yeah. Hey, can we look at out tonight? Yeah. So we're alive. You and me all right. Yeah. We can leave the world behind. Yeah. For tonight. Yeah. Hey, can you look at out tonight? Tonight. 
Thanks for having me. Thanks, WHYY. You know, I went to Catholic school as a kid and uh, for a few years, and uh, the curriculum was uh, <laughs> all that public television, HYY, education, and TV. Uh, I'm happy about that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. the winds and the sky, and the, the blues and the ocean. The thoughts in my mind send a day into motion. I can fly out the right to fall. It's another trying to roll. Scares me more than anything in the world. Scares me more than anything in the world. The leaves on the trees and the colors and flowers, the thoughts in my mind, and I toss it around for hours. I can win a miraculous. Having a bubble after choose, yeah. Scares me more than anything in the world. Scares me more than anything in the world. Scares me more than growing old. Scares me more than growing cold. Scares me more than being told it's all on me. Loss of victory. Well, the stars in my shine and the clouds in my coffee. The thoughts in my mind that slowly consumes me. I can hear what I can hear. Just sitting around like this scares me more than anything in the world. 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 Scares me more than so I've been doing uh, concerts like this uh, um, in this interim on this uh, stageit.com site. Got one tonight. Lee Tracker up toward the sun, I think. I don't believe how anybody really can feel anyone else. Cause every day, some ungodly thing goes astray and it weighs on my heart. Where is relief? Yeah, what's the solution? Can somebody please pray for us all? What are we gonna do? This is what I'm coming to. It's breaking my heart. Feels like it's so falling apart. Show me I'm wrong. Please make me a liar. Don't wait too long, cause I'm losing my faith. Cause everywhere is a sad delusion. And someone declares our kingdom is for Show me the way. To resolution, put weapons away and save a soul. What are we coming to? What's this world coming to? It's breaking my heart. Feels like it's all falling apart. Yeah. Followed by a, a double chorus. 
this tight trim. <laughs> All through that history, you made sure your conscience be clear. But there's two sides to every story. Here's what you don't want us to hear. That they once had harmony, and you could not understand. How they could live so free You drove them off of their land Then you made laws to serve only you And you laughed at their spiritual way Are you deserving a praise and blame? But how will it be the same? Are you deserving a praise of blame for them there? Well, they once were royalty, but you could not measure their worth until you sold them like property. The salt from the sweat of the earth. You ship them away, they were joining from land. You stripped them and gave them new names. I deserving a praise and blame. For they'll never be the same. I deserving a praise and blame. For they'll never be the same. They once had God given grace, truly a gift to behold. But soon life's light left from their face, dark within your house home. You made them take vows to serve and obey. You really must have been afraid. Are you deserving a praise and blame? But they'll never be the same. Are you deserving a praise and blame? For they'll never be the same. Are you deserving a praise and blame? But now that to be the same. Are you deserving a praise and blame? For they'll never be the same. Yes. Thank you for listening. So Jeffrey Gaines is my name, and that's what I've been doing, playing to the computer. Thank you guys for uh, being out there. Um, here we go. We got time for one more? What do you think? Thumbs, nods, nothing? No. I'll just play till it cuts off. <laughs> Last 15 minutes, I suppose. And now I sleep in the dream of the person I might have been, and of the three again. And now I'll speak like a someone who's been to the highest peaks. And then realize there's got to be some hero in me. There's got to be some hero in me. There's got to be some hero in me. They've been suppressing their every desire. They do nothing overwhelming. 
She's lost a sparkle and he's lost a fire But their future looks very dim And I see he in And I see purity I simply let myself go I developed to go dependency And as I grow older so many places that I've never been With time tapping my shoulder I hope it's never too late to begin And I sleep in a dream of the person I might have been And I'll be free again And I'll speak like a someone who slipped to the highest peaks and so that I begin And I swear The time press is greater than anyone's Until I believe again And I wake And the dream fades away And I face the day And then realize That there's got to be some hero in me This hero in you and in me but Sometimes it's so hard to see there's got to be some hero and Thanks, Ma. That's what I said, everybody. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thanks for hanging out. Cliff, we'll talk later about how our, uh, our pop screens have dissolved. I don't have mine either, and it just completely dissolved. So I wonder if that's what happened to yours. Thank you guys. Have a wonderful rest of your uh, afternoon and evening. Thanks so much. That's Jeffrey Gaines performing in a great way to start out uh, our WHYY house concert series live session. And in the comments is a link to uh, Jeffrey's show from later tonight. Uh, if you want to hear more, uh, more from him, thanks again, uh, Jeffrey Gaines. Really appreciate it. Uh, so we'll switch feeds now for our next performance. Uh, Cliff Hillis is a singer, songwriter, producer based here in the Philadelphia area. He's released a number of albums that had songs featured in movies and on TV. He also performs and tours with various bands, including uh, members of the Hooters, U.S. Rails, Patti Smith and Scandal, and the orchestra. Today, a uh, very special day today, you'll be among the first to hear his new single, Seven Sisters, uh, that will release digitally everywhere tomorrow. So very excited to have uh, Cliff Hillis with us. Uh, help me give him a virtual round of applause. Cliff, appreciate you being here. Thanks so much. All right. Hey. Thanks. It's a it's a great honor to be part of this this awesome group of uh, songwriters. And thank you guys uh, for putting this on. So you know, we need to keep keep music going how we can in these crazy times we're living in. But um, yeah, I have this new song called Seven Sisters that's actually coming out tomorrow. So I'm just going to start off with, especially because it's a different tuning. So I'll, I'll get that out of the way. But um, it's a song that I, uh, I wrote just before the whole uh, pandemic thing started, actually. And then uh, my friend Kevin Killen, who's a fantastic Philly musician, played a bunch of parts on it, sent me some tracks. And my friend Greg Marigas played some parts on it. And then uh, Louis Clark, who's a fantastic cellist keyboard player all around musician who i know through um the orchestra which is the band one of the bands i play in and uh he played some cello on this so it's coming out tomorrow this is called seven sisters sleeping like the seven sisters hold you in Listen as the whispers keep you safe from harm. Dream the dreams of all the ages till you get it right. See the words fall off the pages in the dead. Thank you. 
been like the seven sisters Hold you in their arms Listen as their gentle whispers Keep you safe I will fix my gaze up to the stars Tune back up the standard. I'll do. Uh, I'm gonna raise my mic up a little bit. It's funny. It's a whole new world now. As Jeff says, singing into the computer. But hey, we do what we gotta do. I'll send this one out to uh, to Lisa because she likes it. And uh, thanks for getting me invited onto this show. Uh, this is called Love Not War, the title track to an EP I put out a while back. suit of armor and me with my fist in the air gathering up our armies making a battle plans waiting for that signal do if I see and what if I land hold on let's put up a flag of truce because we both know that it's no use It's time to make love, not war. Sneak a couple more songs in, in tidy sets. Um, I've been doing every Sunday, uh, twelve thirty p.m. Eastern, uh, Facebook Live shows from my personal Facebook page is facebook.com/slash Cliff Hillis. So swing on by there. Um, they're gonna, I'm gonna keep doing them for a while. You know, see what see what makes sense. Um, but this is a song that I, I wrote, recently wrote uh, with uh, a singer-songwriter that I'm a huge fan of, uh, Mr. Rhett Miller from the band The Old 97s. I've been working on it for a long time, getting, on, getting to write a song with him because we've done some shows together and got to be uh, friends a bit. And uh, this is called Let's Pretend That It's Midnight. It's going to be 
Um, this new song is coming out, Seven Sisters, tomorrow, and then later this summer I'll have a full an EP that this song will be on. So let's pretend that it's midnight. And I must credit my wife, Beth Lennon, for uh, coming up with the title of the song, because it's a quote from something she said. Let's pretend that it's midnight Everything will be quite alright Silence is deep, everybody's asleep Let's pretend that it's midnight Let's pretend that it's 2 a.m. Go all the way and come back again There's a place and a time all that we can find Let's pretend that it's midnight Well, you know Let's pretend that it's New Year's Eve The ball is dropping, baby, please don't leave Pull me in for a kiss, nothing sweeter than this Let's pretend that it's midnight I feel like you feel the same way So let's get out of here Let's up and disappear This lazy sunset's taking far too long When the morning comes And the words I say to the deeds of love Like the world won't end We'll live forever and just pretend We can close the blinds We can take our time Let's pretend that it's midnight Well, you know that I mean what I say And I feel like you feel the same way Let's pretend that it's midnight All right, if, uh, if it's cool, I'll do one more quick song. I've got, I got a two-minute song that I'll This will be the, this is the flip side of the Love Not War uh, 45. And this also, there's a theme in my recent songs that the, my, uh, my wife, Beth Lennon, uh, says something and, and it's clever. And so she says, go write a song. So I go write a song. But, uh, I'll end with this. Um, it's uh, been an honor and a pleasure. And um, looking forward to hearing Joy and... And Eric, and this, uh, thanks for having me. Uh, this is called The Buddha's Belly. Everybody wants to rub the Buddha's belly. Nobody's scratching the Buddha back. You're pushing all your luck. You can never get enough. So come on now. Give that boy some slack Everybody wants to live the good life Nobody's sweeping up the mess You hurt the ones you love Then you blame the Lord above You're putting the big man's patience to the test Everybody wants
monster of the Buddha's belly. But nobody's scratching the Buddha's back. You're pushing all your luck. You can never get enough. You know it's time you faced up to the facts. You take it, take it now. It's time to give it back. Thanks. Thanks, everybody. Yo, Sandy. I just want to say hi. <laughs> Thank you, Cliff. Uh, great job. Really appreciate uh, appreciate that. I, I was going to give me a little hands in the air to make it feel real. Uh, thanks so much, Cliff. Really appreciate it. That's Cliff Hillis performing on WHOI's house concert series live sessions. Uh, I hope you're having that. Just a reminder, his, uh, his single does drop tomorrow, Seven Sisters, uh, everywhere digitally. Uh, so you can check that out if you want to pick it up. Uh, please do that. And I hope you are having a good time this afternoon watching these live performances. Just a reminder that this is this is part of WHYY's mission, right? As, as your trusted news, educational, and arts programming source here in Philadelphia, South Jersey, and Delaware, uh, you know, we are a member-supported NPR and PBS station, and we, we'd like to thank all of our members who are out watching today. Uh, and without your support, of course, we could not be able to, to do programs like this. And, and you can help support that mission uh, right now, or when we're done here, uh, just go to why.org and click on that little donate button in the right uh, corner, and you'll be able to, uh, to support uh, valuable programming like this in such a weird time. It's really important to connect, I think, with live music and just connect with each other. And this is one of the ways uh, WHYY is helping make that happen, and we're glad that you're a part of it. Uh, while you're at why.org, by the way, uh, if you are so inclined musically, uh, you can even submit your own original song to be a part of our digital house concert series going forward. Uh, just go to whyy.org and you'll be able to find the uh, house concert series and be able to submit a song. Uh, if you've got one in your back pocket, we'd love to hear it. Uh, so now back to the music. Our next performer is Philadelphia-based Joy Ike. She started playing music in earnest in college and she left her career as a publicist in 2008 and it since has played thousands of shows uh, around the country uh, over the past 12 years. Uh, NPR is All Things Considered, which of course we very highly regard around here, right? Uh, all Things Considered said this about Joy. Uh, the depth of subjects that she tackles in her poetic lyrics are perfectly complemented by a unique blend of neo-soul with just the right dash of pop. Joy will be sharing songs uh, this afternoon from her latest album, Bigger Than Your Box, Songs that boldly explore what she refers to as divine discontentment, uh, the restless middle ground between what is and what ought to be. Uh, so we're really excited uh, to hear what Joy will be sharing with us today. We're very excited to hear you perform. Uh, Joy Ike, thanks so much for being with us. Uh, take it away. Hey, everyone. Looks like I had to unmute myself on this end as well. Um, really excited to be here sharing songs with you guys. This first song I'm going to play is called How She Floats. And this song was probably about 12 years old, um, but lots of songs have kind of been coming back to me in different ways. Um, taking on new meaning this year with all that's happened. And this song is really just about, you know, those times in life when you're not really swimming or going out life full force, but you're not sinking. And I kind of think of sinking as giving up, but you're in this kind of in between and just trying to make it through the day, the week, the month. And I'm sure we've all kind of felt like that in some respect these last few months. So uh, this is called How She Flips. How she floats. Well, it changes every day. And how she loves. Well, she loves stronger every day. And how she prays. Well, she prays harder every day. Sometimes it's hard to believe what she say. Hey, hey.
years or months in our heads. And what happens next? <laughs> Hope you guys are floating along okay, not sinking, even if you don't really have the energy and you wake up every day and you're just like, what is going on? What twilight zone am I in? Hope you're making it through. Um, Sci-fi is my favorite genre and I was in the middle of Man in the High Castle and I decided that I was just going to give that a little break since I was living in a sci-fi movie. So uh, I don't know if you guys are feeling like that, but that's how I've been feeling. <laughs> um, and uh, this next song is called Hold On. And uh, I wrote this about five years ago for a family member and uh, three friends of mine who, who were all and who have all still been going through some really difficult health struggles. And, um, you know, I think as artists, we're always trying to uh, save the world through songs, um, which I guess the debate is still out there about whether, whether or not that's possible. Um, I think so, but um, I don't know what you guys think. Uh, and uh, yeah, this song is for them, but the song has also kind of taken on new meaning in this new context. And um, I guess at the end of the day, I think about all of the fears that circle around us every day when we wake up and we're not sure what the future holds. And um, the song is about uh, deciding that those, those fears aren't going to become your identity and that you're going to break through those fears and fight through and walk through each day courageously. <laughs> It's not what you want, but your hope is coming. Like an oak tree underneath the ground, a small seed waiting to come out. It's not what you want, but your hope is coming. Life takes all you got, but your hope is coming. Come on, girl. Oh, 
put up walls and someone pulls them down. You think they'll help, but they kick you to the ground. It's not what you want, but your hope is coming. Well, life takes all you've got, but your hope is coming. Oh, it's not what you want, but your hope's coming. Oh, come on, girl, hold on. You will find your song. Come on, man, stay here. Breaking all the locks, unassuming fire, burning up the lies. Bigger than your box, breaking up the locks, unassuming fire, burning up the lies. Bigger than your box, breaking up the locks, unassuming fire, burning up the lies. Bigger than your box, breaking up the locks, unassuming fire, burning, burning on. you wanted, not what you asked for. You didn't need any of this. We never saw this coming. Oh, it's not what you asked for. Oh, it's not what you wanted. Sometimes I get a little screamo, so uh, I don't know what's sounding like out there, but hopefully it's sounding okay. <laughs> uh, that last song was off the uh, more recent album called Bigger Than Your Box. Now she slopes with her songs a little bit older. Um, this song is also off of Bigger Than Your Box, and it's called Walk. And um, you know, it's been a crazy, tumultuous month. The world's kind of been responding to the death of George Floyd in you know, so many different ways. And uh, I wrote this long post on my website on my blog uh, a couple of weeks ago, just kind of reflecting on it um, and thinking about okay, how do you how do you talk um, well about something, you know, and um, maybe help people to see a different point of view so we're not all just fist fighting. And uh, I referenced this song, which is a song that I wrote. About six years ago, and um, it was for an organization in DC that was called Bread for the World, and they were doing some advocacy work and wanted uh, some songs to pair with the um, campaign they were doing. And uh, this song is a byproduct of that. And um, um, really, at the end of the day, it's uh, the song is about the weight, carrying the weight of the world, and feeling so overwhelmed by all the things that we see on the news every day or read in the news every day that it can feel um, like a drop in the bucket to do anything and kind of feel like um, maybe there's nothing really that we can do to affect change. Um, and so this is, uh, this is really just about that feeling and also about what it looks like to maybe um, think about change is that, you know, that, that uh, saying of eating an elephant, taking small bites at a time and thinking about your immediate world and the things around you and the people around you and, and um, also just the heart, you know, like what, what it is that, you know, what, what, what goes in comes out. And, um, and uh, the things that we think, the things that we say are really a byproduct of 
what's in here. And so the song is kind of all wrestling with all of those thoughts. It's called Walk. Oh, 
you. Thank you. Well, um, I got one more song for you guys, and I really appreciate y'all listening. And uh, so I'm uh, from Pittsburgh, originally from Pittsburgh. I've been in Philadelphia for five and a half years now. And um, this song hails from Pittsburgh. And uh, if you know it, please sing along. It comes from one of my favorite people. Um, I never met him, so I don't know him personally. But I have a lot of love and respect for him. And uh, a couple years ago, uh, the PBS affiliate in Pittsburgh was doing a series and asked uh, Pittsburgh natives to write, uh, to do a cover of this song. And so I kind of wished he was still around and I'd love to, one day I'd love to talk to him. Two, a three, a four, a because I can finally unmute myself. Uh, Joy, thanks so much. Uh, great way to, to end your set. And, and we're not done yet, but Joy, you do have my vote for the power of a, of a song. So I'll, I'll vote for you on that one. Uh, thanks again so much, Joy Ike. Uh, our final performance uh, this afternoon comes from Eric Shankman, who rose to fame and acclaim as songwriter and guitarist of the Spin Doctors in the 90s. And man, did I listen to a ton of the Spin Doctors in high school and college, let me tell you. Uh, last year, he released his third solo album, Who Shot John, which shows his many sides from raw rock and blues to funk, soul, pop. And we're very happy to have him round out our first ever WHYY house concert series live session so please give a warm virtual digital round of applause and welcome Eric Shankman. Eric, thanks so much. Yeah. Okay. I'm hoping I'm unmuted. <laughs> thanks, bro. I don't even, I don't know how I can how I can do anything but compliment all those performances. They're great. Uh, yeah. So I have a record. It's right there. It's orange. And you can get it or listen to it on all the usual channels. Um, so yeah, you mentioned my. Oh, by the way, that's my pop right up there playing cello at Curtis in Philadelphia in 1958. So I'm thinking about Philadelphia today. And uh, I'm going to play a couple, couple, three songs, a couple of three songs, as I like to say. This is a song that really applies to the pandemic, um, but it's written about just trying to resolve a relationship. Uh, it's called Locked in the House All Day. <laughs> Yeah. 
It's cutting the top of my head off. It's good. I like to think of the notes going up that way. Up to the upper room, people. There's a lot going on in the country right now. There's a lot going on. Uh, I just want you all to remember Black Lives Matter. We gotta get this stuff done. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
friend the Martin guitar and I'm gonna play a ballad for you now it's really nice to uh, play for who's ever out there um, I still feel like I'm playing a gig but I also feel like I've been in my house for like four months <laughs> so to all those musicians out there man I feel you and um, to all those people out there doing important stuff you know I feel you too and uh, here's a friend a uh, friend from a friend of mine this is one of my favorite songs my favorite song I never wrote by my good friend Corky Lang, written uh, for his mom. All right. And so, shout out to my mom who survived this flu and got better. So, uh, hi, mom. And uh, hi, Philly, South Jersey. Come on now, y'all. This is a song by Corky Lang, sung by Eric Shankman. My orange record is on the wall. You can find me on social media if you can spell my name right. I play guitar with the Spin Doctors. If you can't, they'll find me there in this world. You and I fly above the clouds Follow in the eyes Love has filled our hearts Love has filled our lives You and I don't care about time Time just leaves us all behind But time is what we have Things we come to know. 
when all things come and go in this world. All things come and go in this world. Thank you, Philly, South Jersey, WHYY. Special shout out to Lisa Gray White and my record, Who Shot John, available on BizTone Records. Lots of videos on YouTube. Find me on social media. I love y'all. Take care of yourself. Thanks so much. That's Eric Shankman uh, rounding out our, our performances today. Uh, a great way to, to round things out and, and finish it. Thanks so much, uh, Eric. Great job. Uh, thanks to all the, our other performers as well uh, Jeffrey Gaines, Cliff Hillis. Joy Ike, and of course, again, uh, Eric Schenkman. Uh, what a great way to end your Thursday, right? Can't beat, <laughs> can't beat uh, some live music. And uh, I know I've been starved for it, and, and, I, and I hope uh, you've enjoyed uh, as much as I have, because I certainly have. Uh, well, I want to thank you for joining us for WHOI's House Concert Series Live Sessions. Special thanks to all our members uh, in the audience today. And don't forget that uh, special events like this are made possible through uh, your support. So if you've enjoyed being a part of this virtual concert, uh, we ask for your support so we can continue to bring these kind of uh, arts and culture events uh, like this to the community and really connect uh, over, as Joy said, the, the power of song. Uh, and I think it's been, uh, it's been really meaningful and enjoyable uh, for me. So if you've uh, felt that as well, uh, we ask that, that you support what you enjoy. Uh, and, and want to hear more of. So just head over to whyli.org uh, and hit the donate button. And again, if you're musically inclined and want to want to be featured in a, in a house uh, concert series uh, online uh, in the future, you can go to whyli.org as well and submit your uh, original song uh, and, and we'd love to hear it. So thanks again to all our artists, to Jeffrey Gaines, Cliff Hillis, Joy Ike, Eric Shankman, to everybody else behind the scenes, to Lisa and everybody else who's put this together and Emily. Uh, thanks so much. Thank you for being with us. Uh, have a great day. We'll see you next time.